Okay, let me do 22 with the computer, and I'm at the computer now. I'm going to type in reset, and what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to type in the numbers. I'm, I'm looking at the notes, by the way, that A is equal to, I'm assigning A the value 7.15. I'm assigning B the value, let's see, uh, 1.98. All right, and I'm going to assign uh, the letter C the value of 135.44. Now, when I do that, again, my claim over here is I, 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 I probably should be using radian mode. So I'm going to type this a little bit differently. I'm going to type star pi. I'm going to approximate pi. I'm just going to put pi uh, dot n, approximate it, and then, um, you know, it's pi divided by uh, 180, right? Hit the return. And I just want to show you what C looks like in radian mode. It looks like this over here. Now someone says, what are you going to do about that? You know, I just did the problem paper and pencil. I hope you remember that. And what I did first was I figured out what C was. Right? Now what I say C was, C was equal to, I'm going to write this down for you. It was equal to the square root SQRT. Right? What? I'll write this down then. It was A squared plus B squared minus 2 star A star B star cosine of C. All right, hit return. Now I want to display C for you, see what it looks like. And what does C look like? Well, it looks, you know, it's, it's, it's a long number there, but I'm just going to round it to the nearest uh, decimal place and uh, two places. Going, it would be 8.67 then, exactly what we're saying over here. Now, let me go to the other thing I was doing. I was using a lot, a lot of signs, and I'm going to type it in. And let me type in what I'm, I'm looking at. Uh, if you recall, we just did this in paper and pencil. Uh, B, I'll write big B down now. B is arc sine. What was the arc sign of, uh, let's see, um, 1.98 or B, I'm sorry, B star the sign of the angle C. But now you, I, I see he's um, in radian, right? And I, I'm, I'm good, uh, good with that. And then I'm going to divide it by, uh, let's see, um, C. Put this over here. And let me hit the uh, return now. All right, I'm going to display B for you, but there's going to be sort of a problem over here. B, B is going to be in radian, and I want to get B into degrees. So what am I going to do? I'm going to take the B now, and I'm going to multiply it by uh, 180, and I'm going to divide it by pi. I want to approximate pi, and what do I get? Whoops, made a mistake. i got to see what I did. Oh, I see what I did already. So how you make a mistake? It doesn't make sense to me. Okay. So what do I get over there? I get a number. This is in degrees, by the way. And what's the degree number going to be? Let me just take a look at my answer key, by the way. Um, it should be 9.22 degrees. All right. So let me go back. And uh, again, I'm not trying to confuse anyone. I do want to get um, the A. All right. Now, what's A going to be equal to? Let's write this down. A, and it's confusing, is going to be equal to Let's see, it's 180 degrees, but I'm in radian mode, by the way. So it's going to be pi minus b minus c. I'm going to display a for you, but I want to get this into degrees. So what do I do? I'm going to take the a, multiply it by 180, and divide it by pi. And approximating pi by doing that. What's a? 35.34, right? This is in degrees. Now, Grant, the same says, well, you know, I'm using a different computer than you are. Yeah, whatever you're using, become familiar with it. One of the problems students have, though, when they're doing problems is they misunderstand um, the use of their calculators, and they, they think they can work it, and they get different answers, and they say, oh, it must be wrong. Well, you know, I'm not saying I'm, not, I'm right all the time, by the way, but I hope these answers are simple enough that you can match his answer. Not because you want to match a teacher's answers, you want the right answer. You want to be able to get the right answer and be able to convince yourself and others that you've got the right answer. Thank you.